Member statements. The member for Oshawa. Thank you, Speaker. I stood in this house not long ago to stand up for provincially significant wetlands and for Duffins Creek, a beautiful but more importantly a vital and necessary wetland in the Durham region. Again, I'm asking this ambitious Premier to stop wrecking the environment. Knock it off with the MZOs, which allow the Minister to override local planning rules and run roughshod over environmental protections. Stop weakening conservation authorities. This government has been inundated with calls to stop their attacks on conservation authorities, an attack they snuck into the Budget Bill 229 and Schedule 6. The province's Greenbelt Council has asked this government to stop moving on MZOs and to remove Schedule 6. The Canadian Environmental Law Association recommends Schedule 6 be withdrawn and instead recommends that government support conservation authorities. And from a November letter to the Premier sent by the Chiefs of Ontario, Ontario Regional Chief Roseanne Archibald writes, quote, we are all treaty people. Duffins Creek protected wetlands, which has been granted a minister's zoning order to fast-track development, happens to be located within the traditional and treaty lands of the Williams and Pre-Confederation Treaties. Granting an MZO to bypass public participation and due process to rezone the Duffins Creek wetland complex would be incredibly short-sighted, undemocratic, and an infringement of Section 35 and treaty rights. The increased use of MZOs by this government is a disturbing abuse of power, especially when applied to override environmental protections." End quote. Speaker, voices from across the province are loudly telling this government to stop attacking the lands, the green space, the wetlands, and the water. We will never be able to undo the terrible damage this government is hell-bent on doing, and their private interest priorities are destroying our province.